Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. You're in the zone with me, and you are watching me play System Shock, the remake edition. It's a demo version, by the way, so it's an alpha stage. And this, and this part where I, if I'm correct, I use a keyboard, and I suck at keyboard. So you'll see me aimlessly go around the place, completely lost and dumbfounded, like, where do I go? Where do I do this thing? I'm so lost. But anyways, no, I mean the deep. Um, the demo was actually nice. Um, and it was a nice tryout for it, um, the System Shock remake. So I mean, I'm I'm kind of hyped up for this game when it comes out like next year. And you know, there's a lot of promises because this is a really deep RPG. And um, yeah, let's check. I've got some interesting stuff that I was not paying attention to. And it's me going aimlessly around. Like, was I supposed to pick up the pipe or something like that? Trust me, it was a lot of moments I've been very, very stupid. So, yeah. Yeah, this is going to be some small narration, by the way, because I'm not going to talk that much over this video. Because, well, I will talk about some really key aspects of this video because, well, I like make fun of myself. But anyways, enjoy some of this video because you're going to be bored to death in it. Nathan Darcy is the science officer on board. He'll have information on shutting the laser down. His office is on your level near the central hub. Get there immediately. See what you can find. In this section, I was pretty much playing around with the control scheme, the mouse um, sensitivity, because again, I'm using a mouse and keyboard, and that's not my custom. Again, it was still fun playing around with the mouse and keyboard overall, because, you know, I was having fun. And I was looking around the place, and I'm still looking at some stuff. I thought that was like a friendly robot until it jumped me. Right about. Oh, I don't know what to do. I was hitting it. In the animation for um, attacking um, said objects, it doesn't look that smooth. <clears throat> Again, this is just an alpha stage, so I'm not hold I hold no grudge towards that because it was still fun to play. And this is just me just collecting body parts and items and things like that nature, but we haven't got to the most funniest part in this whole damn video. So by all means, keep watching this awfully boring video. And I'll explain more why I was felt so stupid in this game. Anyways, continue with the video.
how this section in this video where is, is I'm sorry, is where I become extremely stupid. Because there's a um, keypad over there, and I never looked on the wall. You see that wall right there? It's four, five, one. I didn't, I didn't pretty much put two and two together because, again, I was using a keyboard and mouse. Again, I'm trying to put so much blame on the mouse and keyboard, I'm just pretty much blaming my lack of insight on this whole crazy and sad predicament that I had to go through. Ha ha ha. So anyways, yes, I was pretty much fucking around like, what the hell do I do? It was no really objective and it was still it was still new to me how to get things going and I was so used to to the like the old school type of things like they show you where direction goes to. And yes, I'm still playing around the whole mouse and keyboard thing. Ha ha. I don't actually saying hi in this video, but anyways. So uh, again, I'm just pretty much customizing to see what I can do. Or oh, remember some key um key um gameplay keys or gameplay moments or whatever the case may be. But anyways. This whole video is just me trying to figure out what the fuck I'm supposed to do with this keyboard. Well, not keyboard, but um, I'm still there. Password code. Yeah. Finally, folks, it hit me like a pile of bricks. I finally looked in the wall. I was like, well, not yet. I'm still looking around like, what the hell do I do? How do I get it open? I'm still going for inventory, in here, in that. It's just that situation where I became extremely, extremely not so bright in this game. And that's okay. I like games making me not so bright at times. But it didn't come out right. Anyways, so when I go through this whole stigmatism of Trying to what have that? Trying to find what I'm trying to do. Something hit me. I don't know what it was, but it was just something in my mind. Like, wait a minute, something's not right here. Something is not right. Do I have to keep going through this goddamn inventory list and how it ran? Blah 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 blah. So we're gonna get to that moment in a pretty much short moment. And drum roll, please. Not yet. Not yet. No. I'm still aimlessly going throughout the building multiple times. Still lost and confused. Lost and confused. Going around. Lost and confused. Lost and confused. So this is a very much a long segment that I really do have. I find this discovery of the numbers on the fucking wall. But again, this is just me playing just how I always do. Trying to figure out new things that I can do, break, or figure out something by myself. I didn't need nobody's help. So, yeah, I broke the camera because for the sake of necessity. 
for nothing. Anyways, also, if you guys notice that my screen was a little bit fuzzy or going out of color, that was due to on the game because I took a um, health, yeah, health packet and some other health items and mixed them all together, which I took them all. And my, my screen got a little fuzzy. I don't know why, but again, the game is still new. It's in, it's in the, yeah, it's a demo, and again, just trying out new things, see what the game can do before I hit just like the launch date. And again, this is where I reach my enlightenment moment. Just turn around, Isaiah. Isaiah, go to the freaking wall next to the desk. It's right over there, idiot. Right? No, uh, uh, there you go. Like, uh, uh, uh. And like, oh crap. Right. So it's four, five. Why hit that again? Just one idiot. Alright, let's go kill some. Oh my god, the zombie! Yes, there was a zombie, and I could not strike it to save my life. He was kicking my ass, too, by More so than the robot. So, this was just extremely funny for me to do. <laughs> but that was fun, though, you know? I found a new enemy I can kill with a pipe. And here I go, moving some stuff to my inventory so I can get some more help. I still know what the. I still have no idea what the hand is for. I don't know. Anyways, so going to this big old nice room. What else can go Welcome wrong? Back to Citadel well, two Station. things really. One, I'm still lost, and two, there is another zombie. Somewhere. 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 Ooh, pack it. Take that. Take it. Take it. That. Oh my God. And there's another zombie. I don't know why I'm screaming to the camera. I don't know if I already played this already, so I don't know why. So. Watch me fail, try to kill this damn monster. It was kind of funny at first, and then it got annoying. It got funny again. <laughs> okay. I think you got heard enough of my voice. I'll chime back in when it comes to the end of this section very soon. Right now, I'm just going through my inventory and checking all of my control patterns and sensitivity to my mouse and everything else. I'm all the last in me. Okay, going out.
So I grabbed me some new stuff and some new interesting items. No one found that I can use that box for medical uses until I actually read it like, oh, I can't use this box. It's just a box. Anyway, so I found some new cool items. And again, this was a cool storage room that I found. This was sheer like going to, like, I was like exploring new things, buying new items, collecting stuff. So I can like this about this game. Collecting new stuff and interesting items in this game is kind of fun. But it's kind of Mr. Huff. Still trying to figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do in this game, but again, it's still a demo, so I'm not holding no gripes to anybody. And so, about to walk out soon. I'm gonna equip that grenade. Okay, right, right there. Okay, good. Now, get out and figure out what the hell I'm gonna do with that grenade. Walking out. There you go. Walking. Walking. Okay, I'm gonna throw the grenade. Alright, good job, guys. <laughs> this was still funny. <laughs> now we're going to the next session where I use a controller. Finally. <laughs> Everything's all in order, now I can do this again, and then this time I have my controller in place. I had to really work around this game, get, um, get the coordinating, uh, get the um, programming right for a controller and a, and a keyboard. And finally got it to work. So this is the second playthrough of this demo, oh, this is too sharp. And again, I'm actually doing really, I'm doing okay. I said okay, I'm doing the best thing I can do. I'm just doing okay, and this is where the part where it gets more interesting and fun. Hopefully. I said hopefully. And see where I go from there.
Citadel Station. We hope your somnolent healing stage went well. You are currently in the healing suites located on the first level. All levels can be accessed by the elevator in the room. In Alpha, we hope you have a pleasant stay on Citadel Station.
how I like this puzzle right here. It's within the um, the area in the game. And I didn't notice that was a puzzle it's until I like, looked over and like, oh, okay, that's kind of fucking cool. Which it was. It was super cool. I didn't know. I didn't. I didn't. I just. I just. Yeah. Let it be there. Can I talk today? I happily just found this crazy puzzle on the wall by luck. It was all by luck in this whole second gameplay viewing. I know, right? It's crazy. So I connect the dots and it worked, finally. And so I go down here and see what lies beneath the other side of the zone of the And I know the whole thing. And you're like, what? Because I didn't know it was actually to that. And still some more dead people stuff. Yeah, yeah. And this is where I get a gun. And it's a workaround, work throughs kind of give it a take about everything else. So let's see what happens next. Sadly, this is where the video is going to come to a close because I was still I was messing around with my um my graphics and, and the demo and stupid me it well you're going to see very shortly it's going to crash me and yeah again that was a fun demo to play overall and I might go back playing it again so look out for that video and that's about it it's going to crash in about five 
four, three, two, one and a half, one sixteen, and and dead zero.